Wandering ghosts, it's a cry of the blue orb that's floating in the air. <sighs> ha! I don't remember how to do this one. Don't I have... Got it. <coughs> Alright, cool, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. I don't remember how I got that one, but I did. So, you yeah, know, thanks guys. I appreciate it. Fellow humans. Toodaloo! Alright, yeah, I remember you. One, two, da 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 for, for some reason, I was like, I wanted to record Devil May Cry. So I did, and now, look at me. I didn't record Devil May Cry for a month, and now I'm back. Isn't that how good YouTubers do it? They don't record something for a month, and I just kind of pop back, like, hey, surprise, guys, I got Devil May Cry back. It's <laughs> just so stylish. The milk and sick style, boys. Oh. Well, thank you for the blue orb. I appreciate the blue orb. I'll probably only pay this chapter and then end the recording. <laughs> I didn't, I don't really want to record for like too, too long. I just don't. I don't find that much. Being completely honest, I didn't. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> Being honest, I didn't really, really, really want to record today either, but I promised myself I would. And that's probably why my voice is a little bit, eh, 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 eh. and plus it is, it is a bit light. I don't want to be like loud. I don't want to be screaming my little booty off, making a little butthole of my. What the fuck? Hold on. What? Did I not pick that up? <clears throat> I'm going for that item. God damn it! I'm going for it. Give me, give me, give me, give me the blue orb. Boom. Blue orb. Four level. Give me that health up. Boom. More health. Exactly. That's exactly what I wanted. Bruh, why are you doing this to me? I don't like your kind. I don't even explore that area. I, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I just know. Slap. The ghost statue of night looks like something was placed here. Did I forget an item? Oh, poop. Did I forget something? No, wait. No, 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 no. Nah. There's a couple of bases under the privy of whether you should I use the sign of chastity. Yes. Use sign of chastity. Don't know how sign of chastity. Chastity is a brain, but alright. Just remember what I have to fight here. Is baby, he's back. He's alive. He's a little bitch. With his big goddamn sword. What's going on, bro? How you doing? You doing good? You know, I'm going to. Uh, get fucked. I remember the, I don't remember any of the combos on this thing. <laughs> Probably because I don't have them. Haha, get fucked! Ah, Neil Angelo, why are you doing this to me? Uh, ah. You know what, I'm not even afraid of you. I got like six gold orbs. No matter what you do to me, I'm willing to live. Even though I just realized that's not how the gold orbs work in this game. That is not how gold orbs work in this game. Give me a second, mate. I'm kind of stuck down here. Uh, Dante just had a little bit of a... Dante's a bit stuck. You know what? You know what? I'm just going to spot you. I'm about to get smacked in the face. Really hard. Okay. Yeah, that's right, bitch. Oh, get fucked, man. Oh, get fucked, boy. This is Devil May Cry doing the same combo. Boom, boom. 
You know what? Alright, let's do this. Boom! Dead. <laughs> See, I'm I'm not good at this game. I could probably I do more, I I'm telling you, I can do better when it's Devil May Cry 3 or 4 or the reboot. Mostly well, because there's more stuff to do. I will gladly say that Devil May Cry 3 is probably my favourite. Out of the originals. Four is up there. Uh, I suppose, but honestly, my first playthrough of 4, I absolutely disliked it. I hated it so bad. Because it was just boring. I, I got through Nero's and I had to replay as Dante, and that kind of was like, oh, I don't really like playing as Dante. And that's just really because everyone was like, dude, Dante's the best, and I agree, but the thing is, the way they handle his weapons, I, I like the style system. I got I could probably do Dante pretty good now, because I played Devil May Cry 3, and he's basically just an improved version of Devil May Cry 3. But, my issue stemmed from the fact that yeah, my issue stemmed from the fact that yeah, he's pretty fun to play, but for a new player, because Devil May Cry 4 was my first Devil May Cry game. A little fun, f actually, technically three was my first, but because my friend had it on Xbox, but I couldn't get past the first boss. <laughs> I couldn't get past the the first boss. I got my ass kicked. But. Like, I had no idea what I was doing with Dante. They're just like, alright, here you go, have fun. They just kind of dropped Dante in there, and at the time, I was like, alright, okay, I kind of got used to him. Kind of. Uh, but then, they bought him new weapons, and I was like, okay, this is a little bit difficult. And then they gave me more weapons, like, really? They gave him weapons, like, every chapter he got a new weapon, so he never got really time to work on one singular weapon. So you always, like, imagine if if, in this game, Dante got Alistar, and, but then he got Ifrit, like, two, a mission late, later, and I'd be like, okay, what? It'd be a bit too much, and that's, that's the thing that I had with my Craft 4, like, right now, I could probably, fucking, I could probably beat every difficulty on Devil May Cry 4, I, I played that game way many, too, too, way too many times for someone that didn't like it, for some reason. When I was, a, when I got it, I bought the special edition, and then I was like, yeah, you know what, okay. But then, recently, like about three months ago, I got the physical version of the PS3. So I got the physical PS3 version. For some reason, I don't know, I was like, you know what, I'm going to play Devil May Cry 3 on PS3. Because it didn't have trophies, and back then I was a bit of a trophy whore. And to be fair, I am a little bit still now. I have this thing where I need to get every trophy percent to like 50 or above. I don't know why I do. This is some I do. But... And then when I got really into it, I learnt Nero as best as I could. I basically I in Dev Mac 4 I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't learn anything. Like I basically refused to learn anything really. That's I was just a stubborn little prick. I was I was playing it like God of War on easy. <laughs> When God of War was on easy mode, I was playing it like that, and that's just not what Devil May Cry 4 is about. I did get a few S ranks, being completely honest. Uh, and I did beat hard mode with Virgil, which, you know, everyone has, because goddamn, Virgil is just broken. If you, if you haven't beaten Devil May Cry 4 with Virgil, what the hell is wrong with you? He breaks the game so bad. But at, at, at the time, I was like, oh, I don't really like this game. And then on a whim, I saw Devil May Cry 3... Oh, no, no. The Devil May Cry HD collection was on PS3 when that was... Before the PS4 version came out. And I was like, you know what? I'll buy it. And my friend was like, are you sure? You'll probably, like, only... You probably won't even like them. And I was like, yeah, but might as well give them a try. Because I've heard they're, I've heard 3 is a bit better than 4. So I was like, you know what? I'll give it a try. So I did. And now it is probably one of my favorite series. I even like Devil May Cry 4 a bit now. Because orig originally, of course, I didn't know what I was doing in Devil May Cry 4, so I absolutely despised it. I was like, I don't want to play this game shit. But now I'm like, yo, I actually like this Devil May Cry 4 game. It's pretty fucking good. It's pretty it's pretty kinky. Nero is a fucking silver head sex machine. <laughs> Fuck, see how cute it is. Every fucking sentence is cute. Gotta go protect Kiri. 
I swear to God, if Dev Cry 5 brings a reference to the fucking Curious shit, <laughs> I love my ass off. I do, I do remember seeing that the 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 gameplay that was shown uh, versus Goliath was actually Mission Two, so I get the feeling that maybe Mission Um One might be how Nero lost his arm. But that's just my opinion. I would be pretty like a Devil May Cry, like how Devil May Cry Four starts off with Nero versus Dante. I get the feeling that Devil May Cry Five will either start with Nero versus Virgil, who I, I'm gonna say the dude that steals his arm is probably Virgil because it does. I'll admit the the cuffs thing, but I've seen does look like Virgil's clothes, and some people brighten up his face, and it did look like corrupt Virgil. So I will say that it's possibly Virgil. By the way, why the fuck won't you die? Why are you being such a bitch? Bruh. And yeah, I I get the feeling it is Virgil. Uh, that's my opinion. Uh, it, it might not be Virgil. I know this. the third playable character is not Virgil because Virgil doesn't have black hair or tattoos unless Virgil decided, you know, I'm going to myself. But who knows, apparently Virgil decided to go to Fortune and slam a hooker. So <laughs> he might just say, you know what, I'm dotting my hair black. To be a dick. Foolishness, Dante. Foolishness. As long as they bring down South with Bath back, if it is Dante, Vir Virgil, good. I bet they will, because they bought Johnny Iron Bosch and Brandon Langdon. I think his name is. I don't know his last name is Langdon, but his last name is his first name Brandon? That was Langdon. Something Langdon. That's my phone. <laughs> I think it is Brandon Langdon. Why do I keep getting... Please contact Australian... Can you fuck off Australia? I don't have anything to do. I keep getting these bloody things. Like, Please contact Australian... Legal. For a business matter. And I don't know what they want. How you doing, bud? Try and look up Dante's voice actor here, you bitch. Ah, oh, god damn it. Alright, we'll look it up. He's Devil May Cry 3 voice actor anyway. He's Devil May Cry 1 and 2 voice actors. I don't fucking know who they are. Nor do I really care. Because no one talks about these guys for some reason. Plus, they don't really talk that much. Dante 2 doesn't talk really that at all. And, and other than a few one liners. This Dante doesn't really talk that much either. Like people always say, he's he's, he's always had a character, and he's, he really doesn't. He's just one-liners all the time in this game. Never make Craft Three. He has a character. That's that's a Dante that I like. He has a full character. He's, he's full story. Never make Cry One and Two though. It's either one-liners or stoic as fuck with a few one-liners. It's not a character, guys. It's that's just some fucking weirdo. <laughs> Uncle Dante with his one liners. I believe then there's Dan then there's Nero who was also a snarky little dickhead. Which I understand why people didn't like him at first, which is like, yeah, that's fair. Bro, you should be dead. Go away. Vlad Icarus, he could have used Google Images. That is true, my friend. No thank you. Uh, why, well, why did I have to go? <laughs> Fuck, I wasn't paying attention. I wanted to look up Brandon Langdon. I'm sure it's Langdon. No thanks. Turn on. Don't. Turn on data, whatever. Diving into a Twilight Sparkle wallpaper. Alrighty then. Thanks, mate. That's great. Uh, Dante voice. Dante voice actor. His name. I know it's Langdon. I know that much. Toshiyuki, what the fuck? No, that's not that one. <laughs> okay, that's, I didn't even know he had a Japanese voice actor, but alright. 